Hello everyone, and welcome to Portal 2. After just coming off the heels of Portal 1 and its thrilling conclusion, I figure we jump straight into the sequel. So without uh, further ado, let's start up a new game with Chapter 1. The Courtesy Call. Alright. This is, again, one of my favorite games. I love the Portal games. Um, it's just, you know, it's such a neat concept to, 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 to like, work your brain around with the, with the puzzles and such. It's a shame that it's, you know, been almost ten years since the last you one. You have been in suspension for... Days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Okay. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental That's wellness exercise. That's something like exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Ah. Uh -huh. Really you embrace should now it. feel mentally reinvigorated. Yep. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Okay. All right. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Job well done. Roll credits. End of, a, end, end of the episode. Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Hello? Anyone in there? God, that was... Hello? That actually scared me a little bit. Are you going to open the door at any time? Ah! Oh, God. You look... Um... Good, looking good actually. Are you okay? <laughs> are, are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please seat. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay oh. calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all I'm saying. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Okay. Okay. Oh, that looks great. You all right down there? Yep. Hello? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, boy. Hi. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration yep. after a few months in suspension. Mm -hmm. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, mm. and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. Right. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because yeah. that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Right. Do you understand what yes. I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Right. Just tell me, just say yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, <laughs> yes. what you're doing there is jumping. <laughs> uh, you, just, you just jumped, but never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold uh -huh. tight. You see, you don't gotta worry about your brain safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor. Because my brain is so huge. Okay, look, oh, God. I wasn't gonna mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How you doing down there? You still holding on? Yeah. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Uh-huh. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. I can tell. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Oh god. Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Right. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I gonna make it through? Have I got enough uh, space? Um, uh, sure. Just, just gotta get through here. Uh. Uh, it's a bit tight. It's a bit tight. Uh... Whose fault do you oh, think no. it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Ooh. Ooh. Alright, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. You're good. You're good. <laughs> You're good. Okay, listen. We should get yeah. our story straight, alright? Right, if right. anyone asks, uh -huh. and no one's going to ask, don't worry. Right. But if anyone asks, tell them as 
far as you know, the last time you checked, yeah. everyone looked pretty much alive. Yeah, sounds right. right. Not dead. Okay, Jesus. almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. Right. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. Yes. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Uh... Uh, oh, oh. Good news. Right. That is not a docking station. You figured. So there's one mystery solved. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. You're going to hit it. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Yeah, uh, you're going to you're just, you're just, you're just hitting the wall. Almost there. Yeah. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't right. worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh, boy. Did we do it? There we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. Right. But um, at least you're a good jumper. Yes. So you got that, got the jumping on your yeah. side. Yeah, I do. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. All right, buddy. I'll uh, see you there, Mr. Wheatley Man. All right, good luck. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support mm -hmm. so that science can still be done, right. even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. Right. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Hey, look at me. I have an updated model, and I actually move. Isn't that swanky? All right. Uh, Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science. Yes. Even in a dire emergency. Right. If cube and button-based testing cause this emergency, yeah. don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Right. The old familiar ceilings, as they were. It's the same area. Yeah, that's it. I'm sure it's fine. You good? You good? You're good. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This yep. aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm glad the elevator still works great untouched by time when everything else is a for yucked all right episode, episode puzzle one done look at me my brain it's so big if you feel liquid running down your neck right relax lie on your back and apply immediate pressure to your temples you are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which mm -hmm. the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. My ear tubes, no. Rats. Ah, uh, number one. Oh, there it is. Hey, it actually lets you control it now rather than just being timed. That's a nice quality of life change, if you ask me. There we go. Look at me, my big brain, setting records for fastest puzzle times in the world. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Right. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, Please take a moment to write down the results of your test. Okay. Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Cool. How are the employees going to be there if society isn't there? If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, right. sending a cloud, yep. or other governing body that either cool. refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. So any politics. Gotcha. Number two. All right. Hey, you made it. Hey. There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Uh, I can't see it, though. Maybe it... Oh! 
Oh. Hello. Hi. Can you see the portal gun? Also, are you alive? That's important. Should have asked that first. Yeah. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive. Right. And I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour. Yeah. Then I'll come back. And assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. You don't have hands. Right. Brilliant. Go team. Mm -hmm. See you in an hour, hopefully. That's right. If you're not dead. I'll try not to be. My brain is huge. I think I can handle it. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Ratman's been busy. Whoa. God, some of the art in this game is just... Well, it's crazy, but, like, some of it. Oh, yeah, you can zoom now. Forgot about that. Hey, look at me. Uh, where do I go? Over here? Nope, that's a... Oh. With the very obvious path. Ooh, secret, secret tunnels. Through the mountain. All right, all right. Uh, Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics. To share. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. No one saw that. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. Right. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Gotcha. Gotta get that paperwork done. Or else, I don't know, you're gonna get sued, probably. <laughs> I mean, someone does paperwork for some reason. I don't know. I've never been in that position. This next test is very dangerous. Right. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, right. two, okay. one. Hey! Hey! Aww. Let's get behind that. Behind that funky, funky rhythm. Number four. Look at me going through the basically the entire first game. Okay, and then that, and then backwards, and then wow! It's like I, it's like I just transferred my oh. How do wait? Is there another cube? There's another cube, isn't there? Yep. I must say. Great work. Because yep. this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Okay, so this is the part in the other game where I thought I would break the glass. It's this part where you break the glass. Okay. So, let's say, can you not continue? You can continue. What's over here, though? What secrets does this hold? Unreason. A bunch of math. A bunch of these. And then secret. Water. Any beans? Oh, beans. How <laughs> to get them beans? All right. Onwards. Man, this game sure does like to throw loading screens at you. Good lord. Maybe I'm just solving it too fast. My brain is too big. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or mm -hmm. other objects from space, please right. avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Okay. Thank you. Alright, I got my stairs. Look at me. 
Uh, I need... Is there a portable surface up here? Yes. What can I do with that? I don't know. What does that do? Huh. What does this do? Ah. Hey. Looky there. Like a glove? Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. Okay. All aperture science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Oh, good to know. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. Okay. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I was like, can I shoot through there? I cannot. But what I can do is that, and then I have the cube, except I missed. Now I get the cube. And now I jump through. Awesome. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, right. welcome. And remember, testing is the future. Yes. And the future starts with you. Right. Um. Okay. Where's the orange portal? Oh, it's down there. Okay. Uh, uh, that. Okay. Awesome. Got the box. Where does El Boxo go? Launch me out of that one, please. Okay, that didn't work. What if we try... Well, now I gotta go get the box. Okay. What if we try it again? <laughs> oh yeah, I just need to get over there. So this is the... Okay. And then we put the El Boxerino right there. And I gotta do it again. You know, fourth time's the charm. Alley oop, and I missed. That was an intentional miss, is to show you what not to do. Looky there. Good work getting this far, future starter. Right. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, right. please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. Dope. I'm the biggest one of... big, <laughs> The biggest one. I have the biggest brain of my uh, tribe. <laughs> To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, right. all safety devices have been disabled. Cool. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Yeah. Hey! Oi, oi! Hey! I'm up here! Oh, Hi. brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Yes. Oh, the, do you know what? It just goes to show people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? <laughs> Brave. Uh -huh. Put the portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay. Just pop a portal right yep. behind me there, and come on through to the other side. Okay. Hello. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. Right. They told me yeah. never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail, or I would die. Yeah. But we're out of options here. Right. So get ready to catch me, Yeah. all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Right. Ready? Yep. One. Two. Two. Yeah. Three. That's high. It's it's too high, isn't it, really, yep. that? All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Right. Okay, ready? Yep. One. Catch me, catch me. Ow. Ow. I did it. I am not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> I can't move, then. That's the problem, then. Are you still, are you still there? Could you pick me up, do you think? If you are there. Oh, brilliant, thank you. Great. Yeah. Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Oh, yeah. Um, 
Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not. I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? No. Do it. I can't. I can't do it if you're watching. No okay. crap. <laughs> All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. Oh right. yeah. While your back was turned, pick me up and off we go. I can't put him down. <laughs> Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Let's yeah. Go. Hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, just follow the rail, actually. <laughs> oh, no. Yes, hello. We're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. Hello. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Keep moving. Hello. Hello. Hi. I'm different. Yeah. Is that all you got to say? No? Okay. Goodbye. Ooh. Oh, another, another loading screen. Yay! <laughs> oh, God. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. Right. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber. Oh. And she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. Right. This looks familiar, doesn't it? Okay, I'm going to lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. Oh. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not going to believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. That's crazy. This human escaped, and uh, nobody's seen him since. Yeah. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened, right. and then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't cool. touch me. Didn't even need to play the first game. Hey, look. Looks like you could fit right in there. All right. Well. Wow. Okay. Down these stairs. Right. Jump. This, actually, look at it. That is quite. A, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Oh. Ah! oh, still held. Still being held. You think that's a great job? You've yep. applied the grit. We're all fine. That's tremendous. Yep. You are welcome. Ah! I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Oh yeah, that's a ah, far away. Done it again. <laughs> This is the main breaker room. Jesus. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Right. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't, uh, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But right. as soon as you look at something and it doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look, right. at, well, look at other things. But yeah, no, you understand. I got it. Can you see it anywhere? No. I can't see it anywhere. No. Nope. Uh, tell you what, plug might be, me uh, in and I'll turn the lights on. Might be that brown one up top. Oh. Let there be light. Oh. That's uh, God. Just quoting God. <laughs> Where are you? Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Yeah. No. Hopefully not. Escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Okay. Oh. Okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got oh. it. Oh. This should slow it down. No, oh. it makes it go faster. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Power up initiated. Oh no. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. You um, cannot. Uh, oh, there's a, there's a Ooh, pass. Just okay, hit the mic fine. there. Sorry. It's not a problem. A a a a a um a. Okay. A a a a a c. Now, wait, did I do B? Did I do a pen? Start writing these. Power down. up complete. I don't, okay, 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 listen, all right, new plan, act natural, act natural, we've done nothing wrong. Right. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. Oh, <laughs> no. How have you been? Oh, pretty good. I've been really busy being dead. Right. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? That rings a bell. Uh, oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, My no, portal no, gun. No, 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 no. Ah. Okay, look. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. Mm -hmm. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For some, Sweet Leaf! You monster. Yeah. I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, 
You must oh. really, really love to test. Oh, the incinerator. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. <laughs> oh god, that's such a good way to intro the game. God, I love that. But, I'll save that next part for next time. Thank you, everyone, for watching this uh, episode of Portal 2. Uh, if you liked it, feel free to leave a like. If you want to see more, uh, please consider subscribing to the channel. And if you've got any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. Thank you, and uh, I'll catch you next time. Bye.